All right, I got an email from Melissa. She's one of my human beings. Uh, hey, Lou. Hey, Melissa. I hope you had a great weekend. Yeah, it was good. You know, recovering and stuff like that. But like I said, it was good. I hope you had a good one as well. I was wondering your view on XRP gold or even XLM and silver in regards to how they will incline in price. Will they value a physical silver and gold be worth the same silver and gold in the crypto markets? Okay, let me just say something. Right now, silver and gold, I'm gonna break this down. And crypto, this, my God, you, you could spend hours talking about this, but let me explain what's going on. Silver is about to become a monster. Because in the EV battery market, they need the um, palladium, no, platinum, yeah, it is platinum or palladium, man, in order to make the battery systems. But they just found out that they can also use silver. So you take a look at the price of palladium versus, or platinum, versus silver. So what do you think? All the battery manufacturers around the world are going to be buying in 2024 advanced bundles. Think about that. Silver is going up in price, physical silver. As far as gold, all the nations around the world are stockpiling gold like something horrible is coming. And they're also stockpiling gold because they want to back their currency, fiat, and their CBDCs with something of value. Gold is going to have an explosion in price because everybody is stockpiling it. Pretty anonymous type feeling there. The prices of crypto do not know yet because XRP and XLM are coins that are price is based on utilization. They're only operating at a fraction of where they're supposed to be. But when those central banks and governments start using those CBDCs backed in gold, that's where you'll see the price. I think that next year, if anybody tells you they know what's going on and stuff like that, they're out of their fucking mind. They're lying to you. I know the conditions that are going to trigger things, and that keeps me like looking at stuff. But I'll, I'll leave you with this. There's nine major oil producing production countries in the world, and they always use the U.S. petrodollar, the dollar backed, you know, for the petrol. Eight of those countries are no longer using the dollar pegged to their oil. Do you understand what I'm talking about? So what are they going to tie the currencies to? Gold? What CBDCs? Who's going to move it? Where are they going to move it? What blockchain? 2024 is going to be the year everybody's going to be watching everything. Commodities, crypto, and the stocks if you're into it. And don't be fooled. The economy is not the market. The market is not the economy. Like Greg used to say, Main Street is not Wall Street and Wall Street is not Main Street. We're going to see some wild shit coming. So to be continued.